What's up, guys? I'm Replacing, and this is episode two of this um, of the vehicle showcase series on GTA. And uh, I just well, the second vehicle in this. I think we should go with clown horde this time. And um, uh, yeah, this episode is going to be the. This is actually the Range Rover Evoke. It's supposed to be, uh, but it's actually the, you can see on the front, it's the Galvanator. So, um, oh my god, look at Chrome. Uh, um, um, what colour should we go with today? Um, this is an off-roading car, so I'm, orange looks actually pretty nice. I think we should go with, like, bright orange, because it's kind of yellow also. And plus, uh, can't be bothered to do them because they don't actually make a difference. Suspension, um, can't really see a difference in that. We'll just go sports suspension. Um, turbo, like always, and then vehicle. I think we should go off road. Oh my god! <laughs> look at that. They are tank. Let's go with those because they look even more tanky. Um, actually, no, let's not go with black rims. Let's go with dark brown, which is mainly black, but um, the black is a bit too dark for me. So, go tint that windows, and yeah. So, the Galvanator is in real life the uh, Range Rover Evoke is so nice. And actually, Jesus Christ, this gets up to speed quick. So, we'll just go on top of that mountain and we'll just mess around on there. And, um, basically, this car is so nice in real life. Like, I would really like one of these, but obviously I can't because they're, like, £50,000 or something like that. And, um, yeah, so all of these cars in this area I'll be doing. So that, the Garotti, no, the, yeah, I think, oh, God, I did, sorry, I didn't mean to. And you look, and you don't look real anyway, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> um, the Graboon, the Gra I don't, I think it's the Grabongi, the Grabongi, I think, or something like that. You probably guys are laughing at me because I can't even get it right, but I don't even know what it is. So yeah, and this car is just showing off the other Range Rover Evokes. So yeah, get dicked. Um, if you're wondering why I'm doing this in slow mode, because I've got like. 21 million pounds so i don't think and on online i literally spent my 500 grand like in two seconds so yeah another one of the um forgot what it's called actually it's the was it it is the dodge riper that's it but it's the benefactor serrano <coughs> So let's just go up here. Sorry, nearly hit you. Oh my god, Jesus Christ, this car goes quick. No, no, go on. Can we get up this trail? Yes, we can. So this car off-road, look how quick it goes up hills. Oh my god, yeah. I, I, I'd recommend this. Okay. I, I thought I was going to spin out and go. Actually, I'll take off the music because it might be copyright. Um... So this car off-road is a really nice car to drive. It's got, it's, you you guys probably think it's a heavy car to drive, like it doesn't really turn that well. Your guy, you guys are wrong if you think that because it, it turns amazingly. And I think, no, this isn't the tip of it. I think that's the tip of it, yeah. Um, yeah, I'm just showing you guys. What was I saying? Uh, <laughs> um, I was saying... Oh yeah, this uh, it's not actually a heavy. It's not that heavy. It's like medium heaviness, and um, yeah, the handling's good, speed good when you've fully upgraded it, like I just did, and the colours on the cars, like the colour no, cars, the colour on the car, is just so nice to like. Um, <clears throat> so nice to. What am I talking about? <laughs> they're so they're like they just suit this car so well, and I think I think I think we're gonna try and get to the bottom of this just for a bit of fun. Oh God, this is gonna blow up so hard. I didn't put insurance on it because you can't put insurance. Oh God. Oh oh my 
freaking god. We have ruined this car so hard. Oh my god. And one front one front left tire um metal thing <laughs> I don't know what it's called. Um has came off and that's it rolling down that mountain and you saw how many rolls we did we did about I don't know 15 20 maybe and this car just some smashed windows um some smashed windows tires are intact windows are not intact except one door came off that's a downside that the panel came off which is also downside light broke okay maybe it didn't it kind of survived it's still got the speed and the tires have not been squashed because if you guys if you guys have played this game if you hate like if you really hate your front tire hard it, um it just doesn't well it does do something it um it like you it doesn't move so it's just stuck in one place and you don't go too quick and i think i'm gonna try and go up here again Woo, oh god, that was so bad. Door came off and... Okay, both doors have came off now. Come off, actually. Proper English, Elden God. Um, the bonnet has came off, which is also downside. Um, so I think this car is still still roadworthy. Um, it's not at all. It's not wor roadworthy at all. But this car on the little kind of ramps are ju it's just i i'm this is going to be a car in my garage i i've kind of driven this car a bit but not too much okay can i get up it go on you go oh, god god god's sake um yeah this car is a really i'd recommend it again if you just want to mess around with your mates online and just like Sorry, <laughs> if you're just going to mess around with your mates online and stuff like that. Oh god, this is not going to end well. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Um, yeah, like I said, if you, I'd recommend this car just to pimp out like now and just with your mates, because it's got four seats. So just get your mates in here online and... Um, just mess around with this car it probably wouldn't like f oh god um probably wouldn't withstand the army base it's got speed but the but mm, actually maybe it might do you can go you guys can go and check it out so hopefully you guys have enjoyed this has been electronic plates um yeah this has been the galvanator aka um, the Range Rover Evoke and P